So wonderful. The last and final question, <clears throat> and I'm really, really grateful for the sincerity of all your answers. I really am. Uh, number 21. Yeah. If she, she had talked, she, if she had get those vision were a constellation, which stars would form it? Oh, uh, that's a great question. I can't, first of all, I can't believe we're on 21 already, right? It, it feels like we're only on number two. I know. Uh, and you've just asked me a question which is going to highlight my limited knowledge of the star uh, constellations, but that's okay. I'm a Star Trek fan, so I'll just make up. Uh, and Perfect. I'm a Star Wars fan. Yeah. <laughs> I think um, what are the constellations it would involve? It would involve a nice mix of constellations, both from our solar system, our, our galaxy, and other uh, galaxies, right? Because I think we're all the stronger for letting the light in from more places, right? More stars rather than less stars, right? Uh, and more variety of stars is the constellation that I would like to cultivate. So. I don't know their specific names, you know, it can uh, talk about the bear and the uh, the archer and all those things. But, uh, you know, let's bring together a diverse set of stars and then we'll all be grateful for the light that that shines. <laughs> I tried to throw a curveball and you still answered it and handled it masterfully. It's something about just being prepared. You do the work every day. So you're prepared for things like this. And again, these are some different questions with challenging different ways to make your mind work. And you've answered and handled all of them so beautifully without breaking a sweat. In fact, I think I sweat more asking the questions uh, <laughs> than, than you did having to answer them. So Ferris, I am honored by your presence today, your authenticity and your answers. And I would love for you to have the final word to close out this broadcast, but make sure that you plug where people can find you, where they can support you, where they can buy your courses, coaching, anything that you have, the yeah. floor is yours to close us out. Thank you very much, Joshua. And it's been a real pleasure to be with you today as well. And look, I'm gonna keep it simple for everyone, right? Come and continue the conversation with me, all right? You can do it in one or two places. Come and check out Sheer Ghetto, all right? And just for everyone's benefit, this is Sheer Ghetto. This is the logo, this is the name, this is how you spell it. This is a pillow made by my mother. Right, that's uh, moms are amazing. Moms are amazing. So sheer ghetto, the Japanese word for a sharpening stone. Or come and find me, Faris Aranki, on LinkedIn. All right, I post every day. I reply to every message I get. I just love chatting. And yeah, through those two channels, you can see the courses we offer. You can see there's a free assessment tool to see how strategic you are and how successful you'll be in whatever you're trying to achieve. Uh, but just generally, come and come and say hi, uh, and we can carry on the conversation there. Ferris, thank you very much for your time. Thank you.